In this video, we will discuss the table component and some of its features. The table component will allow you to work with your data in a layout much like a spreadsheet. Every table will have a data source tab where you can filter the records displayed in the table. For example, you might want to have a table that only displays overdue tasks. This can be set up in the data source tab. In the fields tab, you can add which fields will be displayed as columns in the table. And you can edit the columns by clicking the edit icon. Under the general settings, you can customize the field's title, you can disable a field's inline editing, and when editing a connection field, you can enable a link to a child page. You can also change the field formatting, as well as set display rules to change the background color or display an icon based on any field value in the table. For example, if a job is past due, you can set the background color to red with an alert icon. Under Connected Fields, you can add fields from any data table connected to this table. In our case, since each job is assigned to a user, we can show values from the Users table. For example, we can display the connected user's email or any other field from the Users table. In the Links tab, you can add a link which will create a Details page or an Edit page. You can also add links to existing connected pages or delete links and even create an action link which can automate tasks such as sending an email or updating a record. Please see our action links video for more details. In filters and grouping, you can add filter buttons for your users to filter specific records. You can also group records based on field values. For example, you might want to group your tasks by priority. You can also add a summary to sum up or average a column on your table. In the Options tab, under Inline Options, you can add a button to your table to add a record and customize the button. You can also allow your users to directly edit fields in the table. Additionally, when updating multiple records, you can allow your users the option of using a checkbox to mark which records should be updated. In Table Display Options, you can further customize the display of your table. You can add a search bar. You can enable filtering by all or specific fields. And you can also set a custom message when no records are found. Additionally, you can change the limit on how many records to display on a single page. Finally, you can turn off pagination to hide the page numbers. Under Batch Operations, you can allow for updating or deleting multiple records at once based upon conditions. You can also give your users the option of exporting the records and adding existing export templates.